The revolution will be live. 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 Jam for Baby Joe with, with a f second horror short film reaction. That's right. We're we're, we're in the last bit of October. I know y'all saying, man, y'all just really get into the horror short stuff. Hey, listen, okay? Couldn't really jump into it. I don't look for horror shorts, okay? I'm not I'm not really into that. Our issue is that it takes a lot for a horror short to make us like really want to be that interested in it, to want to react to it. Mm -hmm. A lot of people make horror shorts. Not a lot of them are that captivating. Right. This so, one. Something to be kind of good, but they have a weak ass ending. Oh no! <laughs> what ah! happened? Go to sleep. What, what did they do? I'm putting them to bed. I'm assuming they put them to bed. Good night, good night, little one. Oh, you, you wanted a hug? I, I didn't know why I kept running like, from you. It makes me feel like a ghost. Want to hug sometime. All I just want to do is hug. Ah! I love you. All right, bye. Like I, I don't know, but so was it? So you, my brother, recommended this to for this the Thresher. So you seen it, right? Yes, and I. It's been a long time. So he's seen it. I don't recall seeing Thresher. I don't recall. It's from 2014, so I really don't recall this. I'm surprised you bring me something from this long, long ago. But it's done by Mike Diva. So. Yeah, let's see what's going on here. All right. First, first the horse, first, second of the horse short. First was PG. Then we're doing Mike Divas. Let's do this and go. I hope I didn't see this like four times fourteen. No, it's like that. Trapped here? Oh shoot, he was trying to figure out how to he got through the locks a lot. He was trying to figure it out. They're being trapped in a place for days, and what <laughs> and only the guys that forgot the freaking uh code to the lock. I cannot, I'll lose my freaking mind. Does this man even have food?
See, the difference is this man. We can't say this man can run, leave. He's trapped, literally trapped in a room. He can't even get out. So this, this man told a different situation. Based on two hours fourteen, I never saw this. It's crazy. It's also an issue that nobody else seems to react to it. You have someone else reacted to it? Nah, I was kind of still waiting for Corey Kenshin to get on this. Well, Corey Kenshin don't react to people sending them. That's the problem. Nobody's sending them this. <laughs> Spooky, scary Sunday. Which we didn't get all month. Yeah. Hope you're doing well, I, Corey. Yeah. I guess we'll play. I guess we'll keep up on the spooky, scary days. I don't know my Sundays. Spooky, scary something day. Yeah, spooky, scary whenever days. <laughs> well, so. well, spooky, scary whenever days till Halloween over. I don't know. We'll keep doing it after, after October done. That's just oh, what the frick! What the? Yo, what the frick? Yeah, that thing was ugly and black and skinny. And like you, just dark. <laughs> All skinny and stuff. <laughs> Man, feel that cold, boy. So, is did that thing chop him in the room? <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah, he's better turn around like that, huh? Oh, he got it. Well, is that the last one? Okay, okay. Okay, you're happy. Oh! Was it the time to, was it the time to be so happy with it? Get, open that dang door. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Don't stop, keep going. Keep messing with the chain, will you? Oh! No! Oh my god, it was two of them! What the frick? But the question is, how did he get there? Where is he? To get through. To get to our world through him. Oh. So when you saw the tent, he opened up the mm -hmm. thing, the tentacles started to come through. Mm -hmm. So it's using his body as a portal. Mm. All that, and in that weird realm, is supposed to enter here on some Lovecraftian type stuff. So you'll see, like, uh, all the creatures be roaming. They're trying to find a way out, and they use, and they got him, and they retreat him, trying to. Roam the earth and try to kill everybody. 
Yeah, something like that. But what were those things? Like, what the heck? That um, was crazy. Yeah. That was crazy. So that's my favorite horror short ever. Really? Nothing has topped it. Seriously? That's your favorite? Yeah, because oh. what concept? You're, what, where you're trying to get out of, you're trapped in, mm. in the most bizarre way. Mm. Being trapped in something in your dreams is a little more scarier. But when you mm. find a way out, you find out that instead of getting your way out, oh snap, it's actually just like the outside of where it's, I'm it, trapped in. It's worse than what I was trapped in. It's this hellish realm. So my question, when he started unlocking the lock, so that's when the monster showed up. When he started into the last lock, that's when his monster showed up because he'd been there for a, a, a while, for days, looks to be. At least yeah, days to him. It kind of symbolized that you're getting closer to letting us out. Something like that. Oh. Uh, and, uh... So they were just yeah. patiently waiting for him to do it, but if he, if he just chill and realized what was going on, he probably never unlocked it. Probably just stayed there and just, you know, just died. I don't know. Like, no. How he became a portal? That's, that's, that's another kind of question. Huh? Probably doing experiments on him and then did some stuff. Maybe hey, the experiments that they were doing out there maybe connected mm. him to their realm. Mm. Other than that... This looks like a job for it was, Hellboy, Spawn, <laughs> Ghost Rider, all of them. Yeah. yeah. Other than that, it was, uh, it was pretty good. It was pretty good. It was, it was, yeah, it was definitely pretty good. I must say it was my, was my favorite, but it was pretty good. I would say it's the scariest, because it just has the scariest concept. Mm. Get out with the trap. Where it's not like getting out of a house. It's not like mm. getting off the moon. Mm. Nah, you're getting off your dreams. Getting out of your dreams, but you're still trapped in it. Yeah. And at least the worst things for the real world. Mm. Yeah, to me, that's the scariest concept <laughs> ever for a horror short. Well, yeah. Well, on that note, that was the first. That was a Thresher. It wasn't bad. Thresher, Mike, Mike Diva. Uh, pretty good, man. It's uh, yeah, it's crazy. Very Lovecraft. It's cool. You had my brother in there. Well, like a darker version of. It was cool. So, ah! <laughs> Hit me. <laughs> Alright. That's it for this one. We got, we're going to have give y'all more horror short film reactions for the, at least the rest of the month. Try to put out as much as we possibly can. Uh, you know, at least up to Halloween. I don't know what we'll do after. If you guys love us doing, love watching us react to this stuff, maybe we'll do more. Maybe you guys can recommend us some. Like, what you think you want to if we If we haven't seen it already, make it recommend as a short horror film. Especially if the horror short has a female as the monster. Yeah, optional, in other words. Alright. <laughs> Not on some freaky stuff. I was like, change of, change of pace. Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of horror short female as the monster, but it still could suck, though. I know. Yeah, yeah. Alright, y'all. They're trying. Alright, <laughs> All right, y'all. We'll see y'all on the next horror short reaction. Peace.